Many of us can remember what we were doing as a child. Maybe it was going to the playground. So it's jaw dropping to see images of 10 to 14 year olds robbing folks at gunpoint. It's a peaceful day at Watkins Park. Cameron Hamilton lives nearby this North Nashville area. It's a really great community um, and there's also a lot of opportunities uh, here that can be provided to the kids. Hamilton spends his free time giving back to the kids in the neighborhood at a community center. To learn new activities, maybe hone in on some, some sporting skills or things like that, and also hone in on social skills. Yet sometimes kids find themselves caught up in illegal activity, perhaps seeking attention. Well, sometimes they want to feel included. They might not feel, in, uh, feel loved at home or feel wanted, and so they might gravitate towards those who um, are doing the wrong things because they feel more accepted around them. Right now, MNPD Violent Crimes Division detectives are looking for a group of kids ranging in age 10 to 14 years old who may be connected to at least five robberies in the area. These late night and overnight robberies leaving the victims shaken, telling detectives the suspects were armed with guns. And where do you think they're getting the guns? That I don't know. That's a great question. I Marcus Menise is the founder of Stronger Than My Father, oh. a mentorship organization for young boys. Typically, there's no father in the home. Manise says positive role models and activities are needed in a young person's life. I think once you start seeing that more and more, then you'll start seeing crime decrease. Hamilton hopes community members can work together to prevent any more kids from acting out. They have so many people that love them and, and want to help them and give them a bright future. In Nashville, Erin Cantrell, News Channel 5.